style. Yeah, you know, it's 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 pretty close with um, us, Dong Fong and uh, and Brunel. Those guys are right next to each other. Um, you know, a little bit to our west, further from the center of the high. Uh, we're kind of the outlier up here in the northeast, which could uh, go one of two ways, obviously. Although there's only kind of 36 to 40 hours or something left in the uh, in the race, there's still plenty of activity ahead of us. The fight for third place is massive between Bestas 11th Hour Racing, ourselves, and Matt Frey, who we saw on the horizon earlier today. So it could be the difference between a rain cloud. Uh, it's that that close, and what we've got ahead of us is a big depression that's moving through with winds up to 35, 40 knots. We've got thunderstorms and squall activity. We've got a trough of absolutely no wind, followed then by some reaching and some quite strong winds to the finish. So with all these transitions that we're gonna go through, there's everything to fight for and everyone desperately wants a podium place. Plenty of action on deck and probably not a lot of sleep as, as, as we push for the last 24 hours to get to Newport. Brunel very close, Vestas very close. And it will be a nightmare up to Newport. The two last hundred miles will be very stressful after, uh, after uh, last night, uh, which was uh, a tough one because a lot of water on the deck, very fast. Even we had to be a bit careful, I think. Fly, man, fly! So we had a compression yesterday in the high pressure and uh, quite a big compression now after the low. And you know, with the strong winds uh, during the night, we managed to pass uh, two on the tide, which are uh, around 10, 11 miles behind us now. And we put some distance as well with uh, Axel Nobel. And now we are like eight miles to the finish to Vestas and quite close to the others as well. So we have some hope. Still 24 hours to go and a lot to happen. Eight hours ago, we were 235 miles behind. We're now 130 miles behind. It's a 100 mile gain in 48 hours. And as we say on Scallywag, never say never, never give up.